um so um I don't want to show my face like that because I I don't look as presentable but um I hope everyone can see this and everyone is watching so I just came on here to tell you all that COVID is real you know COVID is real my family hasn't been touched by COVID since the pandemic and my mommy biggest fear was always to catch COVID because she had underlying conditions so you know we tried to be as careful so but a few years ago we almost lost my dad to heart attack I don't know how he made it. I can't tell y'all how my daddy make it. I don't know how. But my instinct kick in and I gave him some aspirin. And I said, Daddy, let's go. I can take you to the hospital. And by the grace of God, my daddy, my daddy made it. And that was torture for my mommy. So... <laughs> it was hard because the doctors called me and tell me to bring my sister and my brother <laughs> they call and they said to bring something to eat well they call and tell me my little brother was stable so I was like thank you Jesus I didn't see him on the journey whatever you call the little bed thing I didn't see him because I wasn't feeling well at all. And I was just trying to not pass out in the car. And I never get to say, Abby, I love you. I never get to tell my brother I love him. <laughs> because I was feeling so sick. <laughs> so when he called the doctor back, <coughs> they say that <coughs> he was stable. <laughs> They say he was there, but so I was like, thank you, Jesus, because I just lost my mommy that morning. <coughs> I just lost her that morning. So I was like, Lord, not another one, please. I couldn't take it. My mommy, yeah, love her. Love her to death. <coughs> but um, they called and they say to bring food. Now, I am sick also. But I am not as sick. I have a little cough in here and there, but I'll be fine. So I speed. I speed to Wendy's and I buy him and my sister something to eat. And as I pull up to PMH, I started to vomit. I, all I could do was vomit because I didn't feel good at all. Because I was pushing my body. And... My sister-in-law, Abijah's girlfriend, she came out to give them the food. <coughs> now, here's what I should have known something was wrong. The nurse, she came out and she said, wait. So I'm like, okay. I had no medical issues. So <laughs> he said to me, he stopped breathing. <laughs> he did not have me. And I run, I run, I run, I run, I run, <laughs> because that's we don't know who it come from, but COVID real, and all I have to say is, y'all take your time, please, take your time on this road, wash your hands, wear your mask, if you don't need to go out, stay home, because you might bring them back to your mommy. You might bring it back to your daddy and they can't fight it. <laughs> so please, <laughs> I, I ask y'all to take it serious. 